Maryland is horse country. Here's a fun fact. There are nearly 11 horses per square mile. In fact, horse farms make up 10% of Maryland land. Now, pretty soon, people are going to get the chance to learn all about the history of our horses. Rachel Menatoff is in Reisterstown with a look at the Maryland Horse Library. Well, Maryland actually has a long and storied horse industry, which a lot of people probably don't yet know about. But that's all about to change. Hi, sweet baby. Sagamore Farm. It's storied land. Built in the 1920s and eventually owned by the well-known Vanderbilt family, has bred some of the world's most famous horses. I don't think people that visit Baltimore would have any idea that Maryland has such, so many great horse farms and so much open spaces and just beautiful horse country. Coming soon in historic Reisterstown. Maryland is very proud of its horse history and acknowledges it in many different ways. Is a library and education center showcasing Maryland's horse history. Now we're coming into the oldest part of the building. Cricket Goodall with the Maryland Horse Breeders Association gave us a tour showing us where the artwork, trophies, and rotating displays will live. 20,000 cars a day go by our building, so we're hoping that people who know nothing come in and visit us. It'll be a place for horse enthusiasts but also for those who want to learn more. I think the best part is going to be introducing new people and saying, oh my gosh, I didn't, I didn't know there were so many different ways I could meet horses or ride horses. Baltimore is, of course, best known for the Preakness Stakes, but there's even more to its story. We have steeplechase races. We have fox chasing. We have horse shows. It's just known as horse country, which I think is really special. And the target date to open its doors is early next spring by Preakness of 2022. In Ricerstown, I'm Rachel Menatoff for WJZ. Well, you are passionate about horses. That's I really am. interesting. And the first uh, thoroughbred race in this country was held in Maryland. There you go.